Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, we are doing a Cons of Tarkir draft made with Throne of Eldraine cards. Can you imagine? I want to take this Vantress Gargoyle. I think this card's actually very good. I mean, it's 5-4 Flyer for two, right? It's got to be very good. Um, we're also going to try to build around this, and maybe we can mill our opponent out a little bit. I don't know. Who knows, man? Magic is a hard game. Simply Cole, what's going on? Urchai, Super Fritz, Mediocre Magic Man, Bulmog. Everybody, what's going on, huh? <clears throat> this pack's pretty good. Uh, I got a Tome Raider. Got Castle Vantress. I think Castle Vantress is probably the pick here. Just having a land that lets you scry in the late game seems super powerful. We can probably get more Tome Raiders and more things and more what's a who's it's and slippy dupes. You guys know what I'm saying. Looking through some cards right now, so I apologize for. Okay, what do we got here? Nothing super exciting. Shine Chaser could be decent. Vantress Gargle is a gargle. Maybe we just go Shine Chaser and uh, we try to play like black, a blue, blue white mill. Maybe, maybe. <clears throat> That's what I'm feeling here. I wish cons as well. I'm, I'm liking this format a lot. I think this format's been fun so far. I will undoubtedly get sick of it at some point. But that's just all draft formats, really. Got an opt, a so tiny, an outflank, and a runaway together. Hmm. So tiny is an enchantment. Works kind of well with Vantress Gargoyle. Sacking a creature making a food is actually pretty decent. I wonder if that's reasonable. <clears throat> I don't know. Is there anything, is there any sort of engines that we can use this with? I mean, even just turning every, every time they have a removal spell, turning into a food seems pretty decent. I think it's probably better than anything else we have available. Also, let's go to Shine Chaser. Let's try it out. Let's try Witch's Oven. Let's see what we can do with a Witch's Oven. What can you do with the witches of an early in the bow? I like into the story here. <clears throat> also, it works well with like flutter, flutter fox. So if we get any flutter foxes, I'll take into the story. Especially if we're trying to mill them already with Vantress Gargoyle. Did Joe Sanchez see Joker? No, I'm gonna see Joker tomorrow with. Uh, Nick and Mike and Felipe, we're going to go. And then we're going to eat some Maggiano's family style. It's going to be a good time. Arden Vale Paladin, Opt, Okame Ranger. Roving Keep. It's either Opt or Ardenvale Paladin, I think. Ardenvale's a great blocker. Especially for like trying to fly over their face. I'll take the Ardenvale Paladin. I don't know if we're gonna be able to adamant it that, that frequently, but. Mantle of Tides, you don't seem very good, I'll be honest with you. Plus one, plus two, not exactly where I want to be. I do kind of like True Love's Kiss a lot. <clears throat> oh man, interesting, interesting. I think we're just taking Opt here. This pack's not great. Sir Farron is really good though, I don't know why it's still in the pack. <clears throat> uh, righteousness, silver flame squire. I mean, mantle of tides is fine.
Would I rather have the, the creature? Probably. Ooh, bar oh, prized griffin. That seems like what we want to do here. <clears throat> That's a nice versatile flyer. Oh, outflank and run away to the other came back? That's pretty good. Jeez. I like I like run away together more than I like outflank. <clears throat> oh, roving keep. Solid seven drop. Once upon a time. I think that's going for like ten tickets, guys. I might have to windmill slam a once upon a time. Once Upon a Time is 10 tickets. Oh yeah, we're taking that, dude. We're taking that. <clears throat> Sorry, guys. Look at this rare <laughs> drafting fu. Oh, Fairy Vandal? That's where I want to be. What do we got here? Somebody just resubbed. Local gunfighter. Thanks so much for the resub. Really appreciate it. Fairy Vandal's great. Witching Well or Prize Griffin coming back would make my day. I am of a filthy... Oh, Midnight Clock in this deck? That seems good. Yeah, we're taking this Midnight Clock. Yeah, I got that free draft. Once upon a time, I, I was a dirty rare drafter. <laughs> what else we got? Do, 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 do. I mean, Unexplained Vision, usually I don't want Into the Story and Unexplained Vision in the same deck. They just give you a lot of things to, like... A lot of expensive cards that end up clogging your hand. I don't think Crashing Drawbridge is terrible. That's true. If this is in my opening hand, I can just windmill. So I can just be like, free spell. And they're going to be like, oh, green deck. And I'm going to be like, just kidding. <clears throat> I think we just take the Unexplained Vision. Oh, Hypnotic Sprite seems great. Yeah, that seems good. I'm game. I'm gonna go through these cards while we're drafting here, guys. I just looked in the mirror, boom, and things are looking so good. I don't think Fervent Champion is worth anything, <clears throat> but I'm gonna check. Just so I don't make a fool of myself. Oh yeah, that guy's not even on the radar. We're taking this so tiny. We got a whole nother pack. Deck's looking good for a whole nother pack still. Queen of Ice? That seems good. I'll take a Queen of Ice. Well, if that's not the perfect card. Three enchantment, three uncommon still in the, this pack. We're taking Arcanist's Owl. That seems great. <clears throat> That's like the perfect double colored card for our double colored life. Another opt. I don't know how many opts I'm thinking, but I'll try one more. Hey, Prize Griffin did come back. That's pretty solid. I also like that we have this Midnight Clock to ramp us, right? That's pretty That's pretty sick. <clears throat> and now, you know, 
Lockthorn Gargoyle is a card that actually beat us yesterday. I don't know if it's better than Youthful Knight here. Like, we do want... <clears throat> we want artifacts for our Shine Chaser. And we do want artifacts to hit with Arcanist Style. I'll take Lockthorn Gargoyle. That seems fine. I'll take Drawbridge. Probably not going to play it, but we'll see. Oh, I'll take this Foil Forest. Cause No, nah, I'll just take the Beloved Princess. Ooh, I did look Grange. Mm, possibly playable. <clears throat> <laughs> oh, Stone Coil Serpent. That guy might be worth something. I don't think so, but it's still very good. Yeah, that's 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 a great That's a great open. I'm okay with it. Foil Fervent Champion. Ooh. Ooh. What a time to be alive. That's a whole dollar, ladies and gentlemen. <clears throat> Probably want this Arden Vale Tactician instead. I would imagine. You guys can have your... Your other dude. Your duder. You just looked in the mirror. Burp, burp, burp. Things are looking so good. Oh yeah. I I swear to god I'm gonna have this uh this Soundgarden song stuck in my head for literally the rest of my life. Oh wow. This makes me real tempted to splash one red. Ugh, this card's broken. Yeah, I'm going to take this and we're going to try to splash it. This card's really powerful. <clears throat> Misford River Turtle. I'm hoping to get like two golden eggs so that we can splash this easier. Because I think one mountain and two eggs is probably more than enough. <coughs> I'm also not sure we're a witch's oven deck, but. Frogify. Vantress Paladin. I think we're just taking the Frogify here. Seems great with uh, Shine Chaser. Man, literal zero golden eggs. I like this better than I like Turtle, so I'm going to take this. Oh, oh yes, Tome Raider's great here. Wow. Hoping that Fayboro Elder wasn't a wasn't an expensive creature. Oh, thank goodness! I don't think it was worth anything. Um, <clears throat> whatever. None of these cards are just gonna, gonna make it into my deck. Uh, True Love's Kiss number two, sure. I could probably just play three seven seven maybe. Yeah, that makes Arcanus Owl really awkward though. Maybe we just don't worry about this. Yeah, that's sad. Uh, Griffin seems fine. Didn't say please seems good. I like having a counter spell. Maybe we could just do 276. 
287 rather. <clears throat> we just have no efficient way to get the red mana other than like just hoping to draw it. Rogue Optic, what's going on, buddy? <clears throat> this card just seems so good. Thank you. I think we have to splash it, right? Like I'm not being crazy. Rogue Optic, thank you so much for the reset, buddy. Really appreciate it. You are my dude. All right, so 16 creatures, 25 cards. I think we're just gonna have to. I'm just really on board with it. It just seems really good. I think we can take out the Witch's Oven. Probably two, four, three, four, three, four. At best, this guy is a four, four. So I think we can take that guy out too. And I think this is fine, 23 cards, 15 creatures. <clears throat> wow, they didn't even ask single red for this? That's funny. This is also 16 lands. So it's like they want to add the red, they just can't do it. Yeah, this seems good. I mean, if we just mize into the two mountains, we also have a lot of, a lot of ways to find it. We have off unexplained vision into the story. <clears throat> we could midnight clock into it, Tome Raider. We could also just accidentally mill our, uh, our red sources. That's good. Oh, keep it. Snap, keep it. This this is a great looking. This is a great looking planes. So now you know who gets to the. Okay. Well. You're a great looking plant. God damn. Got him. Is this what getting wrecked feels like? Because, buddy, I'm feeling it. Okay, this hand's pretty good. Next turn we can go this guy, into this guy, keep up this for the turn. Oh, alright. Well, that's cool. No more lands, though. Good on lands. Okay, second red. Show me. <clears throat> now we're definitely good on lands. We can cast everything in our deck except for into the story, but I believe. Oh, alright. We just keep Hypnotic Sprite up? Uh, I've been singing Soundgarden for probably two weeks now. I was singing Outshined. I don't even know what the Pit song is. I think you just made that up. I fell in in the pit. I fucking knew they were gonna have this. Oh god. <laughs> it's about par for the course, I would say. They got a Vidalian click us here. Wow, just don't say please every fucking spell we play. Super cool. Super amazing. <clears throat> having a good time. Having a good time.
good times. I'm having a good fucking time. Fuck off. We have Midnight Clock, so if that resolves, we can actually Thank you. start Midnight Clocking and get our whole deck back, which is pretty comical. <laughs> Chester Pooh, thank you so much for the reset, buddy. Really appreciate it. Welcome back. Oh, good. Seems fine. You got it. That's a got him. <clears throat> Having a good time. I mean, they have like six cards in hand. We have one. All right. Well, we still have our our, our dude. Sure. We have six cards left in our deck? Jesus Christ. What on the earth? Why don't you double block that guy? The fear is real here. <clears throat> Alright, so we have six cards. One of them is a Midnight Tower. Midnight Clock. Alright, two cards left. Fan fucking tastic. This is amazing. <sighs> bring you in, bring you in. Bring you in. Bring another island, bring another planes. That's really obnoxious. I mean, they literally counted our first three spells, so. planes it's my prediction and it was <clears throat> it's better queen of ice here or tome raider i think i'd rather just have the queen of ice slip under the radar Oh look, didn't say please mana.
And if you want to counter my 1-1, one, one, knock yourself out. They did not. Oh, they're just going to play a thing. Okay. Well, that's good. Being able to resolve that seems pretty sweet. Got it. Thank you. Alpha Wolf, thank you so much for the reset, buddy. Really appreciate it. Welcome back. Get off my shoulder. The question is do we want to actually put a counter on this? We want to increase the odds. Kind of, yeah. I mean, I take one, <clears throat> they take one. I'm okay with that. Hello. 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 Oh, look who it is. I'm breaking the illusion again. Why do you have to be like this? Because it's, it's who I am. It's who I be. Can you change? Be different. Can I be different? Be a different person. I thought you said you would love me always for who I am. I never said that. No. Hunter, stop. Me, I know what he is. I'm telling him to not be. Oh. I'm aware of what he is. It's not a mystery. He's a dog. That's true. Hi. Hi. Oh, we got a 7-7? Seven, seven? How'd that happen? Dude, they literally, in the game one, they countered my first three spells with didn't say please. And then they played like three of the mill four guys, and I was just like, all right, well, that's it, I guess. Guess I lose. Had a good game. Because you had a good game. Hey, we got a clock. Yeah. So what was your strategy going in with this draft? Uh, we opened... Fuck, what did we open? I forgot. Oh, we opened Vantress Gargoyle. Okay. So you were like, so oh, you were like okay, yeah. So I'll try to like be artifacts and like milling a little bit, but I'm not like really milling anything, so... Yeah, but still, that is a that is a good old... I'm pretty sure they have the... Yep, this, this guy. Yep, of course they do. Look at that guy. There's a lot of things with Flash in this set. Oh, yeah. Yeah, it's really something. This card's pretty obnoxious. Yeah, it's pretty hard to deal with. Multicolored. Yeah. What a weird, uh, what a weird line of text to be on this serpent. <laughs> what a very random thing. Just like how he has reach. I'm just going to cast my squire. Cast my squire. Cast, cast my squire. What? That's right. Yeah, yeah. Well, he's drawing two cards. He can draw whatever he wants. Can he? Yes. Yes, he can. Un oh. Unfortunately for him. That kind of sucks. We got a clock. <laughs> I mean, we do have a clock. Yeah, it's okay. We're, we're clocking him. So they got a 15 with any good. So they're taking two and we're taking two every turn if we attack with these guys. This guy can't block. Oh, you're getting back your paragon. Sounds good. Whole combat trick Magoo. Magoo? Yeah, that's his name, right? Combat trick Magoo. I don't think that's anyone's name. It's my name. And his name is my name, too. <laughs> oh, Jesus. That's old combat trick Magoo. His name is my name, too. Hey, what do we do when we get 100 million counters on this clock? Uh, you shuffle your library and graveyard and draw seven. Oh. Because you had a bad day. 
Does the clock go back in, or does that get exiled? The uh, exile it. Every time it's been in effect like that, it works, and you exile it. Yeah, but you know, I'm waiting for the day Wizards of the Coast just slips up. They'll never slip up. I mean, they, they slip up pretty, pretty okayly. Pretty okayly. Ha! Huh, jokes on that idiot. He's not gonna be able to untap. <laughs> idiot. Stupid idiot. What an absolute boner. No, it's, it's bonehead. Fascinating. <laughs> no, I'm pretty sure it's boner. <laughs> Buddy, listen. Don't you talk to me about boners. I think I want to start ramping this dude up. Could just draw four cards. Yeah, but I'm reluctant to draw four cards. I'm just going to have to shuffle them all away. I guess there's... Whatever. If he wants to counter, I think it's actually fine. Because then we're going to just draw a million. Yeah. I mean, I would rather us see, like, more cards and just let this gradually tick up. Because then we can play more things. Yeah. God, you're so smart. Maybe you're born this way. <sighs> Maybe it's Maybelline. Yeah, I was going to say, no, nah, it's, it's just Maybelline. Figured. Oh, God, he's going to counter this. You ready? No, you can't have this. You didn't say please. Oh, God. <laughs> Look at him. He's so reluctant because of my clock. <laughs> Look at all my counters on my tickety tock, clickety clock. And it's whenever you put the twelfth counter on. Yeah, it's it's uh when when it had when it, the twelfth the twelfth hour counter is put on. Shuffle your hand, and your thing. All right, so it's going to come back to us. We play a land, put the counter on it, and then uh, get a get a whole new seven. A whole new seven. Don't you dare close your eyes. Yeah. Land. Hmm. Oh, that's smart. We can use it for mana, too? Holy cannoli. This card is baloney. Could have played Frogify on this, but it's whatever. We still can. <laughs> I guess I guess you're right. <laughs> I guess you're right. Uh, four, one. One, two, three, four. One shy of being able to play two things. That's really sad. Uh, Griffin, and then leave open, like run away together or something like that whatever we play is getting countered okay man you're right excuse me for having a little faith no what <gasps> what <clears throat> didn't get countered it's true um hmm. make that guy real tiny yeah I'm, I'm, I'm game that means basically one mana pacifism because do can't block already, so can't do anything. Yeah, can't do anything except be a big old dum dum. And he's doing it so well. He's playing. Where'd you go? Where'd you? Where were you? Uh, I went to go see my dad. How is he? He's doing well. He's eighty years old and very, very cognizant still. Say eight hundred years old. Yeah, he's eight hundred years old and oh very God. cognizant still. Yeah, no, I had a nice little conversation with him. He uh, he laughed uncontrollably at my shirt. Oh, you're going to memory theft me, huh? That's cool. None of these cards are super exciting. So. Your guys. Your guys. Tiny. Is the guy tiny or is the guy and the bird tiny? Yes. Because I think it's way funnier if the guy gets really small and then the bird stays the same. You don't size. think it's funnier if there's a full-size guy and like a regular-sized bird? Like a tiny-ass bird? I think both situations are pretty funny. Yeah, right. That's pretty funny. Oh no, he took our unexplained vision. Not my deck. Hey, is the unexplained vision the same thing going on in Opt? Go back to Opt. Is oh, that... they both look into the keyhole. Yeah, is that the same, that's, same that's Dilly nice. Daddy? It's the same Dilly Daddy. Okay, there's a lot of lands here. Hmm. 
you didn't say please for your steel gaze, Griffin. You need to stop. Oh, man. Do I? Yes. Cause you had a bad day. Um. Yeah, no point in attacking with anyone, really. Well, we attack with both of these. They gain two. This guy gets through. Yeah. There's... Yeah, it's... We just <laughs> we just attack ourselves for two. <coughs> oh, we could have attacked and then frogified this post combat. It's actually pretty good. Oh my God, Franklin, you are very smart. Is your dad Methuselah? Oh, you're just gonna mill me again. Well, mm -hmm. that's twice you've milled this card. Fantastic. And the mountain to cast it even. Yep. Seems good. Oh, look, you milled my other. That's great. Your deck's really, really good. How many of these guys you got? I'll well, sell four first game, so. Oh. Four? Hmm. Hmm. What are the odds this resolves? Zero. Because this is a spell he actually cares about, I'm sure. Yep. Cool. Just gonna. Just gonna fuck off, because. Your deck is miserable, and you're a miserable human being. That's a little mean. Yeah, I don't care. I think it was mean. I I under, I know. I, I I agree. Or I agree that you you think that. That's fine. You're free to. Be nice, Frank. I'll I'll be fine. Ooh, snake. We can make a tutu snake. No. Okay. Oh, could have made a little food. Yum. Look at that dog. No. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Fowler J, your deck was miserable, dude. Your deck was absolutely miserable, just to be clear. That means it was good. I mean, it was, there, it was very good. It was just absolutely miserable. Yeah, it definitely came together. Definitely a solid effort. Uh, I'm just going to pass here. Because I can't do anything else. We can make a two-two snake. Not going to do that. Okay. Not going to do that. I'm going to play a little gentle bed. Uh, my wildwood tracker will become a dose dose for purposes of combat, you see. Classic human peasant. That guy doesn't do it. Oh, you're going to pump it and then... Mm, okay. Fascinating. It's got flying now. So you better watch out. So you're not going to contribute anything. Oh, dang it. It's a sorcery. Nah, it's a sorcery. Dang, I thought it was like the the griffin for a second. Gets me every time, man. I'm like, ooh, it's this card's weird. really good. And then I'm like, oh, it's just a sorcery. I think it's still fine. I think it's fine, too. It's definitely a good card, but the fact that it's a sorcery means it's not a great card. Clocking in, rolled in. Oh, we uh -huh. My name is Nick. My name is Nick. Oh, wow. I like that you were. That's nice that you went right in that happy days with me. Oh, God. They're going to play Curious Pair and Fairy Guide when they're going to draw two cards. Holy Jesus. That's brutal. Hmm. Wow. Everyone has the perfect iteration of their deck. This is the perfect adventure deck so far. Last round to play against the perfect mill deck. And we're just the, the clock. And I'm just like over here with blue white things. I guess they only have three cards in hand. Even after drawing two cards? That's interesting. I kinda wanna just frogify this guy. I don't wanna keep playing keep playing some nonsense. Edgewall innkeeper is blue. Frog. What if it changed the art too? That'd be funny. I think it should, but I'm not gonna demand that extremely unreasonable <laughs> <It's> a, <equ> <laughs> it's, ask of Wizards of the Coast. It's a high. It's a high request. 
Oh no. The wolf fought our witch. Wow. This match is going well. This match makes me want to jump down a well. <laughs> Do you want to play 6-6 six, six, Snake? Mm, I don't know. We can play 7-7 seven, seven, Snake next turn. Ooh. Think about that. I like that. This deck felt really good, and now I feel like I'm uh, not doing... Frank, start drafting bad decks so we can win. I feel like that's a good strategy. Just this guy, huh? We got a food token? Sounds good. You know, when Hat Mike showed up, he had a 7-7 seven, seven with some great options. Then he showed up and... Yeesh. Oh, wow, they just... No, interesting. I'm just going to leave. Where are you going to go? I don't know. I'm not going to leave. I lied to you all. Wow. First you threaten abandonment, and then you tell me you were a liar? Moral character is going down the, going down the drain here, buddy. Ooh. 7-7 seven, seven, Snake Magoo. So we go block, block, we take one, two, three, we go to three, hopefully they don't have any cool tricks, because if they have... Oh, you, oh, you want you want to hear the cry? <laughs> every time I'm here... I'm cringing already. Every time I'm here, you know, I'm, I'm only good for one thing. All right. Baby cry. Get it out of your system. It's like nails on a chalkboard for some reason. Yeah. I think it's because a baby cry naturally is is really shrill and, and unpleasant. So like a baby cry done by you is really it's like it's like the uncanny valley of of baby cries. And it's it's just really cringy. Like it's like invasion of the body snatchers level cringy. Yeah. Uh why can I do that? Well, <laughs> So why can I do that? Um, back, uh, back in the you know the early games of back in er, the eighties, back in the early days of video games, there was this little game called uh, you know Super Mario World Two Yoshi's Island, and Baby Mario cried, and I was like, wow, that's really annoying. And then fast forward to a more modern time, people would cry on the internet. They'd be complaining about stuff like, you know, oh, League of Legends, my character got nerfed. So I just used to, like, anytime they would complain about that, I would just start crying at them because it's the only way to get people to shut up. On, like, voice chat? Yeah. Yeah. Realistically, anytime there's a sound that I'm like, I want to learn how to do that, I just keep trying to make that noise until I can make it, and then I make it. And then people are like, okay, man, you need to leave my house. You're making the dog scared. <laughs> That's actually very good. Okay, okay. Oh, we can tap two creatures. Uh, God, if we had one more mana, we can actually do both. That would be really good. Well, if it's in the spirit of internet trolling, then I'm all in. He's all in internet trolling. It's not even internet trolling. It's just, you know, as as someone who's, like, played a lot of competitive games, I don't like it when people are just like, well, my character is completely oh, we shot to, to shit. Seven next, we get to draw seven next turn, which is pretty nuts. It's pretty good. Because they'll there'll be one on our turn, and then we can actually add two and tap their board. So maybe that helps us not die here. I like not dying. I'm a big fan. Like, if, if someone was like, would you like to die or not die? I always go for not die. TMO6, what's going on, buddy? I've been here, but I was here all along. Yeah, but, I mean, what happens if he was away? What happens if he was lost in the woods and now he's back? What happens? I don't know. I don't know what happens. I That's why I'm just explaining why he missed you. Like, you, you've been here all the time, yes, but maybe he has not. Oh, they're giving that guy float. That's great because I want to be able to. I was going to tap that dude down anyway, my dude. Pop, pop. Oh, yeah, pop him. Pop him and stop him. Pop him and stop him. Pop him and stop him. Pop, pop, stop, stop. Pop him and stop him. 
Oh, we're just gonna end the turn. Add one, two. Ding. Ding. Tickety talk. We got a new clock. Let's see if that does anything. I mean, we got so tiny. Oh, we could actually so tiny right now. That's a good use of manus. <laughs> That's a good use of manus. I mean, we probably should have done it on the Thank curious pair. Why? This guy flies. I only have one flyer, and they're going to have a second flyer. Oh, yeah, turn, so I, I just figured. I thought it was a uh, frogify effect, but yeah, never mind. I'm oh, stupid. no, it's neg one. Yeah. Or neg two. Yeah. TMO, thank you so much for the resub, buddy. Really appreciate it. I guess we'll castle Vantress. Um, what can we do? How much mana do we have? We can. Four, five, six, eight. We get ice five. people. We can draw. <laughs> hey, man, we got this back. <laughs> We always get it back. Uh, I think we actually go Griffin. We just go play these two flyers. Three, four, five. One, two, three, four. We don't have... We're going to have to chump one of these dudes, though. That's the problem. So we could uh, Queen of Ice tap them down. That's what I was thinking. I'll tap one, block the other with... Uh, yeah. With prize Griff. Can I quack like a duck? Quack, quack. All right, so we have one, two, three, four. We have three. That seems good. And we can still keep up opt for next turn. Quack, 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 quack. That's me quacking like a duck. Quack, quack. God, you're amazing. Quack. I feel like we're stabilizing at three, but good lord. Oh, now we're not. Uh, uh oh. <laughs> That's a giant. <coughs> 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 Man, if only we tap down the other one. Literally seconds after he says, I feel like we're stabilizing at three. Like, I don't understand. I feel like the universe is literally just a fucking absolute joke. And they're just trying to, like, make me go insane. Like, I feel like it's actually a simulation. It's okay. I'm real. You're real. I mean, you can't say that if you're a part of my simulation. Like, you literally have no... I'm real. Nope, you have... I'm very real. And you're just going to say it again, I know. Yep, say it again. I'm real. Yep, I know. Just, just keep saying it. Uh, I like the set a lot. I think it's fun. I think hands like this are miserable. That was a good hand. I guess we'll keep this. I feel like this guy's just not going to have... I don't think they're going to be able to deal with this dude. But... Is white underpowered? I'm, that's not my impression. I think white's just fine. You okay? <sighs> Can you stop? You're being ridiculous. Um, what? No, you're being ridiculous. No. Man, and we can block his dumb 1-1. One, one. Take that. I can block it even if it's a 2-2. Two, two. We can block it even if it's a 3-3. Three, three. Well, I have to have four more cards in hand, so I have to go land, nothing, land, nothing, land, nothing. I guess, I mean, that's fine. I guess I could... I was going to say, that's what you're doing right now. That's the game plan. <laughs> like, that's the plan, man. I don't know what the <laughs> problem is. Come at me, bro. Attack. Do it. You won't, coward. Remember that time I was like, literally felt like I was stabilizing, and then they, uh... Look, another thing we don't want to play until we have 26 mana. 26 manus. Oh, he's he's bean boy. Also worth noting, this is a giant, so it does not die to... Uh, yeah, probably cracked open the the giant wrath and was like, well, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to find all the giants. And a whiff. Sounds good.
Sure. I have two cards in hand. Okay. And a curious pair. Lots of things are happening. Let's get our mill on. Our Millie McSchmilly. Oh, Castle Garden Bridge. Garen Brig. Whatever. I don't care. I don't even care. Castle, little mix of Lion King, little mix of Stonehenge. Oh, yeah, finally. We're going to live that dream, my, my, my dudes. Uh, swamp, that card that makes you discard a card of my choice. Don't, don't jinx it. Don't, don't jinx it. Don't, don't, don't jinx it. All right, so. Oh, God. Oh, Jesus. Oh, dear. That's a good one. I guess we can just eat whatever he attacks with. They get to draw a card, but they get to lose, like, two dudes if they want to attack. Two dudes. 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 Man, thank God he didn't have that lucky clover out. <laughs> thank God. Thank Jesus. Jesus. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, I'm just gonna play land here. Do I even attack? Probably not. Nah, he got a he got a big old dumb four five. They're gonna go land beanstalk giant, and we're gonna be like, what do? How do we do that? I guess it doesn't have trample, so we can block it every turn. Also, there's only one damage here. If we get the one, two human rogue and just be like, ping, 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 ping. Only relevant with these two, of course, but nevertheless. Again, feel like we're in okay shape. Why would you say that, Famous Frank? last words. Here comes the, the, the you're dead spell. I hate the you're dead spell. If someone was like, what's your favorite spell? I would <laughs> never say that you're dead spell. Oh, oh, oh. I can I can do just like a normal angry snarly dog. <laughs> Why are you like this? I don't know, man. You should figure it out and really work on it. I can, but there's no goose on the battlefield. What is what is little two one? Ooh, clocky. The cow goes. I feel like they're just gonna literally play the. They're gonna just. Yeah, they're the gonna play the Wrath of God and make us sad boys. I feel like I still can't attack here, which is terrible. We might have been able to get him with like the three three, but yeah, that's what I was thinking. But here comes sad boys. I'm going to play this anti-everything-but-giants spell and, and attack you for seven now. And then I'll make another 7-7 seven, seven after I play it. Have fun. No one, but, but no one had fun. He had fun. Old Julian Simon. Every time someone's got an underscore in the middle of their name and I just got this sweet space, I'm always like, yeah, so good. <laughs> oh. I see. That dude's a six six. I'll just jump with the Tome Raider and this guy. How do you feel about the no change being an R? Do you feel like 
they had any oversights on the performance? Do you think everything is in good? Well, I don't know what the what, what do you, I'm not sure what your question means. Do you feel like they had any oversights on any formats? What is? Uh, I don't think, I don't think oversights is the word you're looking for right there. So I'm not sure what you mean. Um, I think everything is fine. Yeah, I don't see any issues. Do you see any issues? Like, I really don't see any issues in like any formats right now. So. Yeah, it was uh, it was actually kind of funny. I was perusing through Reddit last night, and I was like. Wait, there's a banner restriction announcement tomorrow? And I was like, eh, whatever. They're probably just going to say no changes because I think everything's in a good spot right now. Yeah, we don't have enough information on standard to make that call. We Modern doesn't doesn't seem... Field to death? You don't have enough. You have literally zero. For, like, the format... It, Throne of Eldraine has been legal for four days. Like, you're just not in a position to... Uh... Oh, he's got two food to sacrifice. Oh, boy, that's really something, isn't it? Uh, they're not going to ban any cards in standard when a set has been legal for three days. Like, it's just not a thing. So anyone who's complaining about <laughs> anything related to standard without giving the format a chance to, to settle or, like, resolve is just comical. Like, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Do I even mill here? They have enough cards. I don't think so. Oh, get to ping something? Uh, ba -ping. Get rid of that thing. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I probably just want to wait till eight for this, to be quite honest. But we got eight. Oh, we do. I always forget about the midnight clock. No, I don't live here. That is a lot of rares, actually. Rare, mythic, rare, rare. Rare, mythic, rare, rare. Kill all giants. I top decked it off the top of my deck with my top deck, 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 top deck. And then I'm just going to be like, oh, man, whatever. Wow. Oh, he tapped. Are we dead? Uh, 14. What an absolute... This fucking game is bullshit. 18, like, 19. this is the most amazing... Like, wow, our deck seemed good, and now it seems like <coughs> absolute garbage. I don't even know why I'm playing the last round. You get nothing for going 1-2. Not even, like, 10 play points or something. That's amazing. They literally had a top... They had no cards in hand. They top deck, tap your two guys, kill you. Literally every game that I was like, hey, I'm stabilizing, they literally top deck the exact card they need. One is Wrath of God... Uh, to get rid of all my creatures and be able to attack with their one creature that's untapped, and the other is literally tap two blockers that I have down. Like, could do another draft. Right, but since he's going YouTube, oh, I that's like right. The complete draft. That makes sense. The old YouTube, the Yub Tub. Like, I don't actually think our deck is terrible. So, I mean, it's just literally, I feel like that was like round one. They had the most lucky sequence of plays ever, where they they literally countered our first three spells and milled our top nine cards and then had four mill four cards after that and uh round two they just literally top deck the exact things they need at the exact times like literally exact cards like i i don't know whatever i guess we could have not attacked there when we were at 17 fucking life but i guess uh i guess that was a little risky of us unique username three Seems good. I'm going to get this out of the way now. Okay. That dude has flash. I appreciate that. I literally would have just slammed him on my turn. Yeah, dude. When's Q back? <laughs> that's all I ever want to know. Oh, well, that's good. Let's yeah, play that slam guy that guy on our turn. Does not have flash, so... I mean, I feel like a lot of things are the are a thing in limited if you get the right cards. You're a thing in limited. Wow. Oh Jesus. Three ya. Wouldn't want to be ya. Yeah, I would not want to be ya. That's cool. Look, I almost did it right there. My hat is a thing, <sighs> and it is limited. 
Is it limited? What does that mean? It's limited edition. Only one of this hat in the world. I don't think that's true. Is it? Did someone make that for you? Yeah. Who made it for you? Uh, someone at work. What's or at my uh, at my last job. What's their name? You can promote the, you can promote their Etsy shop. I, I don't know if they have an Etsy shop. They're like a registered nurse now. So. Wow, that's cool. I guess you're just saying registered nurses don't have the skill to knit hats anymore. That's not what I'm saying. I'm saying she Sounds... probably doesn't have a lot of time to knit hats. Oh wow, because what she takes so much effort to focus on her nursery. Maybe I don't know. I don't think nursery is the correct word there. It's just no. It's really unsettling. Like I don't actually get unsettled a ton by, by things like that. Like I'm usually fine, but that's just fuck. It's really unsettling. I'm eating some macaroni testicles. The restaurant called them macaroni balls, but that's just crass. Wow. Are they from the Cheesecake Factory? Because the Cheesecake Factory has a delicious macaroni and cheese. Macaroni testicles. Testicles. <laughs> testicles. Ah, uh, yes. My my favorite part of the macaroni is the testicle. That's, that's literally my favorite part, yeah. I like it when they deep fry it for me. Seriously need to work in a haunted house, do that voice as a freaky critter. A, de- what, a, a baby? Babies are freaky critters, man. They really are, dude. Wow, this is an interesting. Block, block. Here, guys are dead. No, they got some tricks. They're gonna throw. They're, they probably think we're tapped out or something. But we're not. But we got, still, we got this so tiny. It's still a weird trade, like a three-one for a one-one, and then these guys just bounced. That was interesting. Nothing makes sense here. Can I get a planes? Thank you. Oh my God, Frank, are you a magic man? Do I draw or do I arc arcanist? How many artifacts and or enchantments do we have in our deck? We got a few. I mean, we got two of them. We got three in our hand slash four. field. One, two, three, four. Yeah. So how many after that do we have? I mean, or we can just unexplained make this guy bigger. I think that's probably yeah, correct. Yeah, that's, that seems like more. Then we get to adamant it. They're just going to counter it, so it's not going to matter because everyone literally plays. God, they didn't counter it? Okay, we don't want either of these because we have three. Two, Bye. <laughs> Bye, basic lands. <laughs> Can I get a planes? Oh, you mean four planes in a row? <laughs> Here you go. I'm going to get rid of an island, I think. I'm not going to attack here because we're 11, they're at 18. So dealing three to take two doesn't seem great, but. It's a little chicken. I know what it is. It's very obvious what it is. No one is sitting here being like, oh, what's that sound he's doing? I can't put it. I can't put a name to it. I just have no idea what noise that is. That means it's a good chicken noise, right? Yes. <laughs> We're all very proud of your chicken noise. Thanks, man. I'm I'm proud of me too. Oh, Nicholas McSchmickelis. That's my name. Ooh, we can we can opt. Make our guy bigger. I was just gonna play this. We could do both. Soap and water, soap, soap and water. Oh, uh, that guy's good enough. I ain't got no problem with a with a big old chicken. This guy's a four five now? He's better than that guy we just drew. I want to get in there now because we have so tiny for the other gentleman. Did you say he's better than the guy we just drew? Yeah. He is. God, he's a whole point bigger. And he costs three less mana? This card's broken, man. They should have banned this with the standard bannings today. Yeah, get it out of here. This guy's going to get so tiny, dude. Did you see how tiny he got? <laughs> he's so small. I can't even see him anymore. <laughs> Do you think it's a you think it's a griffin? It's a really tiny griffin with a knight on top, or a really tiny knight on top of a regular sized griffin? I, I I like the other one, the other way. Super Fritz, I'm getting real tired of you going to work when you're hanging out in the stream. <coughs> you're gonna have to really work on this. Lord of the Sandwiches. Can you get the tiny TV at work that lets you watch? You mean this phone? 
Yes. One, two, three, four, five, six. If we have one more land, we can actually play this and this, which is a lot of good things. Man, that shine caster would be a three, three. Boy, you know it with float and vigilance. So vigilant. It's the most vigilant. Vigil ant. Vigil ant and adamant. Um. One, two, three, four. We can we can play this and then just keep this up, which seems pretty okay. I like that. I gotta do it the other way though. Gonna whiff every time. Well, we got all of them. Got them all out of the deck. I forgot yeah. to mention that I finally got to quit Starbucks. I had to talk with some of my friends about giving notice because my boss called me an SOB. Oh my god. Dude. That's sad because all my experiences working at Starbucks. So my, it's funny. All my experiences working with Starbucks were good, but my managers are always kind of like really strict. I mean, that's, that's kind of how it goes with jobs like that, right? Like, But Starbucks is supposed to. So here's the thing. The first time I, I was at Starbucks, the first time I worked there, I actually got fired uh, because I had my sleeves rolled up and my tattoos were visible. Uh-oh. Yeah. Which seems utterly ridiculous in 2019. I was, I was going to say... But this was back in, like, 2005, yeah, probably. 2006. Wasn't, wasn't Starbucks supposed to be the super cool progressive... Yes. Like, it was, yes. Like, and, wear, your, wear your knit cap and... Yep talk about your vinyl collection no it's not a hip it was it definitely was like i think starbucks gets a shitty reputation yeah. about like being a overly hipster place it's right. really not yeah it definitely isn't but like i mean it was like open to diversity was like their thing yeah you know like they celebrated diversity you know and it's funny because just not their employees you know yeah you can be diverse but don't work here and be diverse that's outrageous. Yeah, I hope they've changed a lot since then. But like, it still sucked because I remember getting called into the back office and he's like, "Well, I've had to warn you about your sleeves and your tattoos, uh, and um, I'm just gonna have to. This is gonna be your. This is your last warning, so we're gonna have to let you." I'm like, "Are you kidding me right now? This is your last warning, so we're gonna fire you." It was yeah. <laughs> <It's> like, <laughs> well, I was like, "All right, sure. See you later. See you later. Bye." And then you said, "See you later. Bye." And then you kicked over the espresso machine. I was like, you can go kick some rocks. I like rocks. Do you? Yeah. What are you doing right now? So what? tiny. <laughs> He's so tiny already, and they're making him smaller. Hmm. Hmm. Oh man. Speaking of straws, forgot. You've saved nothing. Hey. You've saved everything. <laughs> That's my favorite, dude. I actually get legit excited. The straw says, made from pla made from plants, eco products, 100% compostable. And, like, that shit legit gets me excited. I'm like, yes. I grabbed that, didn't use it, and I was like, oh, Frank will appreciate this. Where'd you get it? Maybe Sweet Patch. Dang. What do you want to do for dinner later? Maybe Sweet Patch. You just went. <laughs> He's like, I don't care. I don't care. Yeah. I went there and there was only uh three people that I uh that I recognized. Well, that's what I was wondering. You kept wanting to go, but I'm like, I mean, like, no, there's four people I recognize. Excuse me. It feels funny because like the odds of that many. Oh god, just come on, dude, just stop. Dude, they put that snake in a tower. This guy's so tiny. This guy's trapped. Well, this guy's tiny too, I guess. I'm just gonna keep blocking here. I don't even care. Yeah, I mean, we gain we gain some life. He doesn't yeah. hurt us. Man, once I get that one, two, I'm shooting. This. <gasps> oh, God, I'm dying. Shooting this guy out of the sky. Oh, hey. Oh, Speak look, we got it. of the devil. Nailed it. Oh, man, we're at 10 counters already? You better start dumping this hand. Take a dump on your hands. Three, four, so. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I'm going to play like one thing here. I mean, we can, we can play Shine Chaser. And we can keep up this plus two plus two thing, right? I guess. I guess. Excuse me? Nothing. Well, I didn't say any words. Sounds like you said some words. This guy got haste, too. 
That's weird. Hey, one, two, you get to shoot a guy and you're very fast. You're so quick, dude. All right, so next turn we're drawing seven. That seems pretty overwhelming. We have. A, I'm waiting for. Uh, do we do we trick them? Do we attack with our negative two five? No, it wasn't. It was regular. It, it the the so tiny made it a negative two. Yeah, no, but do we like do we attack with it this turn? Is yes, but it wasn't. Okay. Two, it was still two damage. Okay. Because this wasn't in the graveyard until combat damage was. Oh was right. Dealt. Okay. 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 Man. There's a lot of happening. I'm gonna take three here. That's fine. I'm going go back to twelve. Choose at random. What are you hoping for here? This lifelinger's been good. And it's got haste too. Dude, why are and they all so fast? quick, man? This is what I was hoping for. Now we can bounce this guy and this guy. Oh yeah. I don't know what you're doing right now. You doing it more doesn't help me know what you're doing. I just want you to explain it. I just want you to use your words and tell me what you're doing. I'm just making noises. Okay, that's that's good. That's good to know. But I was wondering what caused them. What brought these noises on? <laughs> All right, he just made the noise. That's. Oh, also this guy's big again because our <laughs> graveyard's gone. <laughs> that's pretty Whee! good. All right, so they're dead. Wow. All right, so this is how I feel like our deck should be playing. I honestly do feel like our first two opponents got pretty lucky. I think their decks were pretty insane. And I don't think they were bad. I think, I think we got lucky that game. We had all of our rares and mythics. No, but I mean, they literally had to top deck the exact card they needed. Like, if they don't have Ardenvale Tapper Guy, I feel like if we get another turn, we just untap and do good do, things. Do boatloads. Have you seen the new farmland plant-based maple sausages and burgers? <laughs> no. I have not. Um... I get the the Beyond Meat sausages like every other week because they're friggin' delicious, but I haven't seen Farmland. I don't even know. I haven't even heard of Farmland. Let's go to Farmland. <laughs> why are you like this? Because, you know. Because why? Because I'm happy to be alive. Do you want to. Can I tell you about True Love's Kiss? Ye. Ye? Gross. It's really. It's really offensive. You're being offensive. You're an offensive gentleman. Oh. An offensive man, if oh, you will. Hello. Hello, little friend. Flavor was good, but the consistency was odd. Oh, let me see if I know farmland. Oh, that's not what we're looking for. There is one brand of veggie sausages. Are you sh interesting? Farmland doesn't look like a. Hmm. Hmm. Farmland doesn't look like a brand I would trust for veggie sausages. I'm gonna look up veggie sausages. There's one brand that I've tried, and the the, the texture tasted really, really. Field roast was the ones I had, and I was oh, like, f it may have been farm light. Farm light, interesting. I had field roast. And those were like, the consistency was not ideal. They taste very grainy. But all the Beyond sausages are friggin' insane. Because they're Beyond sausage. Oh, man, maybe I should just get this Amazon for this 8-pack for 149 Let's see what that math works out to. Wait, that's $18 a pack? That seems terrible. They're only like seven bucks in the supermarket. What a scam. Too expensive. Under ten dollars back at Whole Foods. Yeah. Sellers incredible markup. <laughs> These brats are out of this world. They're very good. Oh yeah, we'll keep this hand. Yeah, we can we can opt. Hopped? Hop. What? Oh, oh, here he goes. He's having a good time. Guys, next time. There's one cough. Just take it easy. I'm I'm the most easiest taking it person that's, there is. That's completely false. 
You're an absolute maniac. Ah, uh, yeah, I'll keep that. And then we'll draw the extra of the enchantment right now. It didn't. Okay. Nice 3 1. It's asleep now. We're going to set up our mana so that if we draw that sick enchantment, we can cast it. That's smart. How'd you get so smart? God, it took me years, dude. Years. I mean, we're not going to draw it, but, you know, just in case. We might, I believe. I'm in the... I'm just trading with this guy. What are they going to play now, you think? Sanctum Seeker? Kalitas? No, that's pretty good. Kalitas! I hope you whiff. That's, that's rude. Is it rude? It seems like it's a pretty reasonable request from your opponent. No, I I don't want my opponent to have a bad game. I want us to have equally good games. How is them whiffing making him having a bad game? Because, you know, then his card's not working as optimally as it should. We have eight card we have eight lands in our hand. How how is me not wanting them to have another spell in their hand? Well, you could you know, I don't know. Okay. You right. Okay. <laughs> Uh, that guy's not even good, right? This guy? No, that, yeah, that, that guy in his hand. This this yeah. guy's pretty good. I mean, this guy's real good too. Yeah. Thank you. Oh, shouty crunk on the floor, wide open, skeet so much they call her Billy. Wow, oh, Jesus, what's going on? You, you want to read this? <sighs> that oh fine, but this whole killer's <laughs> hoes be drunk on it. <laughs> <coughs> Pop, let me see you shake it, baby. When you do the walk it, walk on it, shake it like a salt shaker. I like it. That's the thing, all right. Playing this stone coil. Yeah, they're just gonna trap it in a castle, though. I'm sure. Trapped in a closet. Yep. Look, wow, exactly what I said they'd do. Never don't have hey, that. Hey, so what about that makes an enchantment? Like being trapped in a... I don't know. Like, I feel like Wizards is getting really loose with the term in of what is an enchantment. You know what I feel like? What? Did you need to shut up? Okay. Uh, Actually, we're just dead. <laughs> so that's cool. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Seems good. All right. We tried our best. Did we? Yeah. When you try your best and you don't succeed. You know this song? No. It's a Coldplay song. That explains why I don't know it. Because you've never heard any Coldplay songs? You've never been in any social situations or public settings where Coldplay songs were played? Yeah, pretty much. That's weird. Would you like to play first? I guess. Who cares? What's the point? We're just going to lose this game. We don't know that. We could win. No. No, we're dead. Oh, yeah, you played a 1-1 one, one, or a 2-1 on turn 1. We're dead. That's what I'm saying. How good I am with this fairy vandal. Oh my god, you remember to have flash. I'm so crazy, dude. I'm so proud of you. Grow up so fast. Throw him away. Sweet removal spell. Seems fine. This guy gets worse when they play more knights, so. Oh, it's just uh, champion of the parish, but for knights. Oh, no, it's uh, whenever you put a 1-1 counter on a target knight when it dies. Oh. Man, Champion of the Parachute for knights would be sick. That'd be standard playable. Probably be too good. It would be real good, especially if it started as a 2-1 uncommon. Oh, there you go. It's your boy. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Well, that's unfortunate. 
I guess we could play the bird instead. I'm not good at this game. It's okay. We can, we can, you know, do. I'll other take two. Stuff. It ain't the end of the world taking two, unless you're at two. Then it's the end of the world. Well, that's the end of the game, not the world. I would say. Maybe they forget it can't block. Oh my god, they did! They didn't see that it can't block! Autumn! Wow. We didn't take two! That means we're alive forever! This game is amazing! I mean, this guy's really hard to deal with, though, let's be real. Maybe they'll never know. Maybe they'll never read it. <coughs> <coughs> All right, take it easy, Nicholas. I'm trying my best. Oh my God, they don't. Know. Oh, I guess now it's not. And it's what indestructible for three? Ugh, crying out loud. <sighs> mill him. I'm gonna mill him. Take it easy. I'm a lonesome unicorn. Oh, that was a good one to hit for them. Hmm. Oh. Oh, yeah. I want them all. I want them all. Put you on top. Put you on top of that. And then put you on top of that. I mean, didn't we want the red on top most? No, it's too white, so it doesn't matter. We're going to have to draw both of them in order to... Oh, okay. Okay! Okay. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah. What? Okay. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Frank, please don't mill yourself. What does that even mean? He's saying don't mill yourself. It's also going to be great timing, too, because we're going to go to 9 on our turn, draw the planes, 11 on our turn, draw the mountain. And then we're going to have the, We're going to be so merry. What are you doing there? Hard to say. Okay. I believe you jump in the line. Rock your body in time. Okay. I'm going to block here because it'd have plus two, plus two. I'd rather trade. Uh, but here's the thing. I mean, they're going to give that dude an instructable anyway. Right, right but I'm going to bounce it so that they can't replay oh, it this right. turn. Oh, right. We have run away together. I mean, if they had, like, I don't know why they didn't attack with this guy, right? Like, sure. Why not attack with the 3 3 as well? None of this is making any sense. So we can, we can actually bounce with their guy and our prized griffin and save both. Yeah. Which is pretty good. Don't mill. Don't mill. Ah! I, literally, I was listening. Yeah, I was listening to you, and then I didn't. I mean, it's fine. We're going to... Oh, but we're not going to be able to play this. Wow, that was so stupid. I'm the worst magic player that's ever existed on planet Earth. Sorry, right, dude. We'll just draw it all. We won't. Oh, God. I feel so terrible right now. We can just redraw it. Yeah, we'll just draw it all. Yeah, I guess. Oh my god. Well, we can mill the griffin. And maybe there's a uh, planes on the bottom of that. Maybe. It's very possible. Maybe. We'll get lucky. I'm feeling lucky. God. I just totally forgot. I was just totally on autopilot there. 
He told you. I told you. They got that. Seems good. I can definitely sacrifice my Lock Thwain Gargoyle. Lock Thwain Gargoyle. What was that one damage? Sure, my dude. Because he's a Lock Thwain Gargoyle with flowers in his eyes. Okay, always yield to this thing. I guess we're sacking Lock Thwainy McThwainerson. <clears throat> clock it up. And clock it. One. Oh, still alive. Rebuy. Yes! We did it. We're geniuses. Just like we drew it up. God, we're so good at this game. We might be the smartest magic players of all time. And now, this guy gets to block too? Oh, shoot. Oh, yeah, this hand is gas. I don't understand the slurp noise. I know. You, why do you just do it again after I tell you I don't understand it? Because, you know, we're slurping up all the value. Then say that. So they have one card in hand, and we know it's. No, it's not that guy, because that guy's over here. Now he's on the battlefield. From worst to smartest over the course of one turn, I vote you most improved player. <laughs> That's all I've ever wanted. All right, we're milling here, right? There's no consequences. Oh, Worthy Knight? Dang, we're hitting good ones here. Uh, Let's put you on... F oh, I guess we don't have a choice, because... Oh, this is just going to make us guys every turn to sacrifice? Oh, wow. All right. So. That's dead. Jeez. Oh, man. See, this is our deck doing it. They're probably just going to concede. They're going to be like, forget it. I can't beat this. Your four mana enchantment's better than my four mana enchantment. Five, six, seven, eight. Yeah, we we can't sacrifice the token. You're right. I, I yeah, I forget that constantly. Yeah, but it's okay, man. We got the tree tree. Got the tree tree. Tree tree. Oh, it's funny because that shooting that creature also gave us the seven cards we need for this guy to go into the red zone. I feel like we're way ahead here. I'm, I'm, maybe it's just me. Why would you say that? I cannot believe you've done this. <clears throat> this guy does have lifelink, so now they go sacrifice their unicorn. That seems bad. Yeah, that's why I'm like, yeah, this is not going to. I think the Amazon delivery is here. Maybe not. Oh, boy. Plus one, plus one counters, huh? Plusums. Plusums, McMussums. Now well, this guy's just getting through. Why don't we just throw the one two away? Okay. Like, it's it served its purpose. Cause it's a jukebox hero. Man, I think the vigilance one's better. Yeah, there you go. Yeah, the guy that can attack and block simultaneously. Get that. Get rid of that man. Do you mean the guy indestructible? Oh, they're just doing both. Sure. Sure. Yeah, they got no cards in hand, so... Can I draw so tiny here? That'd be great. He's <laughs> so small. Uh, shoot your face, I guess. That's pretty good. That blocks this guy all day. Well, I guess the 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, I guess the 10, 10 does too. <coughs> 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13... He could be a 1-1 one, one and, and block that guy all day. Protect from multicolored. That's a good point. We can also just put them to 1 right here. So, that's a thing. 5, 6, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. <laughs> I mean, that seems good. Play this.
I mean, they can gain life next turn, so it's, they're not dead to the token, unfortunately. But I mean, if we played the serpent, they would be, because they can't gain life. Yeah, it's true. This guy can't block again. All right, so it looks like we managed to one two. I think the deck. This is this is probably the best representation of the deck. Not that top deck mythic wrath of god or that tap both your creatures down top deck flash in fairy vandal all right i will take it easy take it easy i mean the problem is even if they oh geez Wow. That's a lot See, of this, this is what I mean. Like, look at these top decks. Like, this is insane, right? Like, now their guy kills our guy, and they gain seven. They're still dead. That's a lot of life. I guess it doesn't matter. Maybe it's maybe I'm just being silly. I'm being a little silly. Flashy boy. Irrelevant, but Hunter, stop. He's like, all right, now that I saw the fairy vandal. I'm out. I'm out. <laughs> Thank you guys for watching. Slam those like and subscribe buttons. Check me out on twitch.tv slash franklapore, patreon.com slash franklapore, coolstuffinc.com, and manatraders.com. You can get 20% off the first three months of any subscription with a link and promo code in the description. I'll see you guys next time. Thanks bye for bye. watching. Bye-bye.